Welcome back to Tech Tutorial Expert. Your one and only platform for comprehensive setup guide and troubleshooting setup issue. If you're in trouble then come in our channel you find the great and informative videos. Here we are presenting a new video that is how to set up TP-Link RE 200 AC 750 extender. In today's time, internet connectivity issues have increased a lot due to which we have to face problems. With the help TP-Link RE 200 extender setup, we can increase our Wi-Fi connection and enjoy seamless connectivity. So stay with us till the end of the video so that you do not miss any step. Without wasting any time let's start the video. Let us take a look at the unboxing of TP-Link RE 200 extender. This will let us know what all things we will get in the box. Inside the TP-Link RE 200 AC 750 Wi-Fi range extender box you will find the main device, a booklet providing step-by-step -step instructions or a power adapter. In this video we will set up the TP-Link RE 200 using the two methods first one ID manual or second one is WPS. Let's start with the manual method. First of all plug your TP-Link RE 200 into a power outlet near your router. Now take an electronic device like computer laptop or mobile phone. On your computer or mobile device, go to the Wi-Fi settings and connect to the extender's default network, e.g., TP-Link underscore extender. Open a web browser and enter tplinkrepeater.net or the extender's default IP address, e.g., 192.168.0.254 in the address bar. Create a password for the extender and log in. Follow the setup wizard to select your existing Wi-Fi network and enter the network password. Now your TP-Link RE 200 setup is complete. Unplug the extender and move it to a location where you need better Wi-Fi coverage. Ensure it's within the range of your router's Wi-Fi signal. Let's move to the next setup process that is WPS push button method. WPS is a network security standard designed to make it easier to connect devices to a wireless network. First of all place your extender and router in the same place. Plug your TP-Link RE 200 into a power outlet near your router. Press the WPS button on your router. Within 2 minutes, press the WPS button on the TP-Link RE 200 extender. The WPS LED on the extender should turn solid, indicating a successful connection. Now unplug the extender and move it to a location where you need improved Wi-Fi coverage. Ensure it's within the range of your router's Wi-Fi signal.